back to another video now before I get into the video I'm just going to quickly talk about Plymouth away last week as you know I didn't go to the game but I did watch it here at home and uh, yeah I think there's only one clip what well, can sum up that game <laughs> Chris Porter missing an absolute sitter. I didn't actually realise how bad it was until I saw the angle behind the goal. Um, yeah, it wasn't very good at all. It was 1-1 at that point and it could have put us 2-1 in front and uh, top of the league. Well, you know, I guess that's football. Uh, you're bound to miss a sitter like that at some point, but I don't think I've seen anything worse than that. But, you know, we've got to move on. Move on to today's game, Macclesfield at home. The Cheshire Derby, if that's what you want to call it. I'm just going to call it the Cheshire Derby because it just sounds all right, to be fair. Um, but got to win today, staying at top three um, to make up for that result last week. Um, so I'm going to go for a 3-0 win today, clean sheet. Um, and I'm going to say Kirk for one. And I'm going to say Porter, just to make up for that sitter last week. Um, and I'm going to go for the new lad, uh, Stephen Walker, because he looks like he's dying to score. You know, he should have gotten an assist last week, because he did assist Porter, obviously, who put it wide. So uh, I'm going to go for him to score a goal today, because um, I definitely think it's coming. But, you know, Macclesfield today, attendance-wise, I don't know how many they're going to bring. Apparently, they, they only pre-sold 64 midweek. Um, which is a bit surprising, but you know, I'm sure there'll definitely be more than that on the day. Um, so I'm going to go for around 500 for them. I can't see more than that tops. Um, but for us, I reckon it's going to be a good day, good atmosphere, and uh, hopefully three points. So come on, you Reds. <laughs>
into half time, 2 0 crew. Pretty easy first half, to be fair. Macclesfield, crap, as I sort of expected. Um, Porter with a penalty, so I know that's one person off my uh, prediction. I did say Porter. Um, and the second goal coming from the new lad, Walker, who I also said. Um, you know, he took his goal very, very well. Jumped into the Gresty Road end with the fans. You know, oh, it was amazing. He did get booked for it, but, you know, snowflakes. Um, that's what modern football is today. You're getting a booking for celebrating with the fans. And I'll never understand why. Um, but, you know, that's what I want to see more of. Um, I really like his passion. Um, since he's come in, he's been amazing. And uh, hopefully he keeps it up for the rest of the season. Uh, but yeah, you know, 2-0, we're flying, um, but there's no more goals to come in the second half, but uh, enjoy anyway. The game finished 2 0 to the Alex. The game was pretty much done and dusted in the first half. Goals from Walker and Porter gave us all three points. Uh, that now puts us second on the Skybet League 2 table. We were top of the league majority of that first half, but as you know, Swindon scoring three goals uh, that put them back up top. Um, just want to mention Stephen Walker. I absolutely love the lad. Um, unfortunately, he's on loan, but whether we can get some massive loan extension at the end of the season to keep him, uh, that would be massive. But his passion uh, for Crew is insane. Today, as soon as he scored his goal, straight into that Gresty Road end. Honestly, I haven't seen anything like it. Everyone just running and trying to get onto him. Oh, it was great. Um, Macclesfield, they came, like I roughly said, around 500. Um, I think it was in the end, maybe 512, if it was that exact number. I'm not too sure, I'd have to have a look. Um, that's sort of what I expected for a small club. Um, but, you know, Macclesfield, as a performance as a whole, it was really poor. Um, we absolutely battered them start to finish. And I, I did sort of expect that when you look at their away form. Uh, they haven't won since October, so I was expecting a win today. And uh, I wasn't expecting them to be anything special. But it's a massive three points and uh, keeps us in the top three and closer to promotion. Um, so I'm really, really looking forward to this next game now. Morecambe away. Uh, I think they are second to bottom, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Or no, they might be third to bottom now, actually, because Macclesfield lost and they drew. 
Um, so, you know, I'm hoping we can go there and batter them next week. Uh, there should be quite a few crew going there because um, everyone seems to be getting the 1009 train from crew. Uh, I'll be getting a different one though from where I live. Um, but it should be a good day out, good day out in Lancaster, hopefully, and another good three points. So please subscribe, like, comment, and uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. You got to pump it up, don't you know?